Okay, what's up, YouTube? We you know who it is. It's Space Shop. I'm at you again one more time. I'm about to give you another video. Remember to leave a like, remember to share, remember to subscribe, also turn on notifications. Check out my social media links are in the description. They're also at the bottom of this video. So, real quickly, I want to talk to you guys about Polypad. Now, I made a video about Polypad previously, a couple videos about Polypad. I don't know how clear those videos were. So, I want to kind of break it down in a more concise manner, going over the FAQs and just kind of giving you guys the information now polypad will be the replacement for tron pad and kcc pad the kcc kcc pad and tron pad will be combined into polypad essentially you will have to unstake your tokens um in both kcc pad and tron pad and then bridge uh your tokens over to the polygon blockchain uh so first you're gonna bridge it to bsc then you're gonna bridge it to the polygon blockchain essentially um this is how it's going to be for both KCC pad and Tron pad tokens. And essentially, um, you can read up on, I'm going to leave the link in the description to this FAQ page where it's breaking down a lot of the different questions that people constantly ask about this whole process. Um, it has a lot of information for Tron pad as well as KCC pad. I'm just going to touch on a little bit some of the information for KCC pad because that's what I'm holding right now. So, you know, there's a few very important questions that I notice here, you know, uh, and I want to kind of address them myself. Now, I just touched on the bridging question. So you guys, you know, have an idea of what that's about. Right now, question three, three says, what will happen to the KCC pad tokens? I'm staking on KCC pad. Now, saying that these tokens will have to be on stake and bridge on BSC pad from here, the, from there to Polygon in the same manner. So, essentially, you the same thing if the staking rewards you bridge it over uh, to BSC pad, then to Polygon. Uh, what happened to unclaimed KCC pad staking rewards? Those unclaimed staking rewards from other projects and stuff like that, you will still be able to claim them and bridge them to BSC and swap them for Polygon tokens. So that's uh, that's fine as well, no problems. Um, will there be any changes to unstaking uh, KCC pad tokens? Uh, so essentially, the only change that's going to be made to KCC pad tokens is that the current unstaking tax will be removed. So you know that twenty five percent tax if you unstake uh, before the first. I think it, it's before. I think. There's a there's a tier, it's a tiered system, right? So I think it's 21 days, 14 days, and then 10 days or something like that. Uh, nah, seven days, 20, uh, seven days, 14 days, 21 days. So if you unstake within uh, before seven days, you gotta pay a 25% tax. If you was unstake before 14 days, between seven and 14 days, you pay 10% tax. Uh, if you unstake between 14 and 21 days, you pay 5% tax. And if you unstake on the, after 21 days, you don't pay any tax at all that will be removed completely there's no there's going to be no tax you don't have to worry about that now this is very interesting now the airdrop is what is significant about this whole thing right now read this guys read this question six this is the most important question uh on this page so it's basically saying what are the announced airdrop de details regarding kcc pad tokens for loyal stakers right so the question the answer says if you've been staking kcc pad tokens for three or more months right december 10th 2021 or before you'll receive 15 percent of your state balance as airdrop right so that's very exciting guys like if you've been staking from from before december 10th 2021 you know how long i've been telling you guys about kcc pad and why you should be staking kcc pad and stuff like that obviously you're gonna win big if you've been staking before that time because you're gonna get 15 percent of your stake balance as airdrop i'm guessing you're gonna get these as polypad tokens since you're gonna have to um bridge over your um kcc pad to polypad and i'm thinking that polypad and kcc pad is gonna be one-to-one -one. that's what i'm thinking um <laughs> that's just my opinion um and then it says if you've been staking for six or more months right so over uh, September 9th or before, you receive 35% of your state balance as an airdrop. So that's pretty exciting as well. 35% of your state balance as an airdrop if you've been staking before September. That is an insane amount. Imagine if you're holding 100,000 of these tokens. You're going to get literally 35,000 tokens. If you're holding 100,000 KCC pad, so you're going to get about with 100,000 KCC pads, 
right now is about three four thousand dollars not too bad well 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 actually right now it's about six thousand dollars because it did pump a little bit but you know it was about three four thousand dollars just the other day so imagine if you had bought it you know what I mean and stake it you know that would have been dope you know 35 percent balance man that would be great so uh yeah man so that's pretty dope obviously some other questions here you could read up on them the next question that i think is very very important next two questions question 11 and question 12 i think is super important right now saying non-circulating kcc pad will not be distributed right so a lot of people was going to be asking about what will happen to the kcc pad team marketing and other tokens so essentially there's some non-circulating tokens that have been locked up right um so essentially what they're saying is that don't worry about these non-circulating tokens they will still not be distributed they will be essentially uh transferred the, the tokenomics for um the non-circulating tokens will also be created for polypad so it's going to be the same tokenomics and all these non-circulating tokens is going to be bridged over to polypad i'm guessing i'm guessing it's going to be something related to them just bridging these tokens over and having them not circulate on polypad as well so that's pretty dope obviously question 12 is saying dot pad has been announced to launch in kcc pad will it launch on polypad also yes essentially dot pad won't even launch on kcc pad because kcc pad will just be migrated to polypad right so yes you can stake your polypad tokens to secure your allocation for dot pad so essentially dot pad is going to be a polypad thing it's not going to even be kcc pad because kcc pad tron pad they're going to be done on April 7th. April 7th is the launch day for Polypad. So get ready, guys. Um, obviously, get ready to do your swap. Swap your tokens over and stake your tokens early because you know that in the early stages, it's going to be crazy with the APR. You know that when, when initially, in initial, initial stages, you're talking about three, 400, 500% APR on your stakes. So you definitely want to start staking them Polypad tokens early. Swap quickly. Stake early so that you can get a chunk of rewards but anyways have a great day please crypto sign out remember to subscribe to my channel i'll be putting out more videos also leave a like share this video turn on notifications check out my social media have a great day please crypto sign out peace